Color goes up late at night Crying behind a computer Trying to make us skin look smoother Just trying to look cuter Gala girl's seen on her feet and on her screen like she has an expiry She's the youngest she'll ever be She shouldn't waste her time frowning What you figure you're getting thinner I want those ribs looking like an instrument inside the phone Watch your tone Bobby's never ends up alone Good evening, good afternoon, good morning Everybody, welcome to a new series I'm gonna do once a week, this is basically short stories. That's why our video is called Horror Stories, Part 1. So, let's begin. Number 1. We bought an old house. Our boyfriend and I, well, not boyfriend, but you know what I mean. He's in charge of the new construction, converting the kitchen into a master bedroom for insurance whilst I'm on wallpaper removal duty the previous owner papered everywhere walls ceilings everything removing it was brutal but oddly satisfying the best feeling is getting a long pill similar to your skin when you're peeling off it off from sunburn I didn't know, I don't know about you, but it kind of made, I made a game, peeling on the hunt for the longest pill or piece before it ripped. Under a corner section of the paper in every room is a person's name and a date. Curiosity got the better of me. One night when I googled one of the names, and discovered the person was actually missing. A missing person. The missing date matched the date under the wallpaper. The next day, I made a list of all the names and dates. Sure enough, each name was of a missing person and the dates to match. We notified the local police who naturally sent out as a crime scene investigator I overheard one police officer say, yep, it's human. Another police officer says, human? What's human? I say, ma'am, where is the material you have removed from the wall already? This isn't wallpaper you've removed. Creepy or what? Hope you enjoyed this narration. There will be more like this in the coming days. There will be a whole Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and maybe Friday, I don't know. But the next three days are going to be horror narrations. Thank you all for watching. And as Carlos always used to love me saying, Thanks for watching, and as always, good luck.